Hi everyone, in this video we are going to see about commodity breakout levels. By watching this video you can gain more knowledge about market. Those who are new to channel kindly subscribe the channel and select the ring bell. Channel name is NSC Commodity Trader. By selecting it you will go to home page. In home page you can see more strategy and indicator videos. By watching this video you can gain more knowledge about market. We are also taking more advanced trading strategy class. If you want to know about it you can WhatsApp or contact the number. If you want to open your Demata trading account kindly select the link in below description or contact the number. The guidance will be provided for you. Crude oil. Let's take a look at crude oil what happened in the morning market. Crude oil from the opening itself today on buying trend. Uh, even during the opening on the buying trend the market even went up freeze also. It touched the breeze and then the broken out. So currently crude oil is trading at the range of 2440. According to current situation the crude oil is facing a strong supportive in 2420 to 2410 range because uh, previously two hours back market went down during that rally it just went down up to 2420 after that it made a comeback so currently we are uh, thinking that uh, crude oil is over overall trend is in buying trend and crude oil is having a strong support near 2420 to 2410 like that so if you see any breakout in 2400 you can sell the nifty um, you can sell the crude oil and you can expect it in downside okay meanwhile uh, overall trend crude oil in buying trend so according to current situation you can buy crude oil even if it break the high means you can buy the crude oil and you can expect according to current situation crude oil in buying trend only uh, if the high also got breakout means you can buy the crude oil and you can expect it in more uptrend also so currently crude oil is facing a strong support near 2400 range let's take a look at copper copper from the morning itself it is also in bullish trend uh, it made a, some strong recovery from 4.15 to 4.25 it's a 10 point rally so after a 10 point rally copper is currently facing uh, some resistance near 4.26 range so according to current situation we can take a look at what will be the supportive level means the supportive levels will be 422 to 423 range that is the supportive level for copper so whenever market reaches 422 to 23 range you can buy the copper and you can expect it in upside because of crude copper's overall trend is in buying trend okay meanwhile if you take look at the high 427 it is near to so if copper breakout 427 you can start a fresh trade at 427 and you can expect it in upside also okay so if you see any breakout near 422 to 23 range you can sell the copper and you can expect it in downside in the meanwhile okay let's take a look at zinc mini zinc mini during the morning time it went down it even breached 150 but it didn't made a strong breakout in the downside after that it made a strong recover during that rally it went up near to 155 range after that currently it is uh, struggling so according to current situation zinc is facing a strong resistance near 155 so zinc need to make a strong breakout above 155 after that only we can expect the zinc to be in again a positive trend and again we can expect zinc more in upside also otherwise from this point onwards zinc will go down so you can expect more downtrend also if it did we are also taking more advanced trading strategy class if you want to know about it you can whatsapp or contact the number which is given below the video if you want to open your dmata trading account kindly select the link in below description the account opening process will follow in future if you want to see more videos like this means kindly subscribe my channel and select the ring bell thank you